Hey, it's hard to beat the kind of weather we've had the past couple of days. Lots of sunshine, low humidity, but the humidity is going to be on the increase as we move into the week ahead. But as far as our weather, pretty quiet. That has not been the case across parts of the southeast. This is what it looked like in Savannah, Georgia yesterday. They've got a stalled system, and that's just going to continue to bring them torrential rains. And a number of vehicles did get stuck in the high water yesterday. Right now we're at 86 degrees. Our winds are out of the east at 11 miles per hour. Relative humidity 46%. Our daytime high 91, and that's right on track. But boy, the morning low very, very pleasant with 66 this morning. We'll be in the upper 60s for Sunday morning. 86 is the current temperature in Rockport, 91 in Beeville, 88 in Kingsville. You can see the dew point temperatures in the 50s and 60s, and that's why it's feeling very, very pleasant. Little bit of a breeze this afternoon out of the east northeast about 10 to 15 miles per hour winds are going to be calm as we head into Sunday morning, but Sunday afternoon again, just a gentle sea breeze at 10 to 15 miles per hour. But the beach and boating forecast for tomorrow also looks very, very nice. Our seas will be running right around two to three feet. Our bays will be smooth and there'll be a low risk of rip currents. Now we're seeing clear skies across much of South Texas. We're under a big ridge of high pressure, so we're going to be sunny and warm for much of the week ahead. Seeing some showers across the desert Southwest here. Here's that stalled system that's going to bring that heavy rain along parts of the southeast. Now we are going to see some moisture trying to work in and that'll give us a slight chance of an isolated shower as we head into Sunday. Again, another slight chance as we head into Monday. Remainder of the week is going to be rain free and most people will not see much in the way of any wet weather. 91 is the current temperature in Dallas, 92 in Houston. Del Rio is hot. They're sitting at 97 degrees. Now, as we look at the rest of the country, a little bit of shower activity across the upper Ohio Valley. Most of the wet weather is in the west. We're seeing showers and thunderstorms across the four corners, then heavy rain coming down along the Pacific Northwest from Portland to Seattle. Now, it is cooler with this system here, temperatures in the 50s and 60s, hot across parts of Arizona, 104 degrees. If we take a look at Billings, Montana, 96 degrees. So most of the central part of the country, very, very warm, very pleasant along the northeast with temperatures in the 60s. Here's a look at our forecast, though, for tonight. Mostly clear and mild. We'll see an overnight low of 68 degrees for tomorrow. Sunny, an isolated shower possible. Look for a daytime high right around 91 degrees. Degrees. Here's a look at the week ahead, and it's going to be mostly temperatures in the upper 80s to right around 90 degrees. A very slight chance of an isolated shower again on Sunday and Monday. Then it looks like we're going to dry up, and temperatures will remain pretty much where they should be for this time of year. Well, with hurricane season underway, we have more information to make sure that you're prepared. Be sure to watch our hurricane special, Prepared and Safe. You can see it on Wednesday, June 17th at 630 right here on Chris 6.